right on water baby and they'll come back first uh, a little bit of a kind of different rock pop band but very cool nonetheless and uh they don't have too much out right now so i'm waiting for more to come out and hopefully at some point it will so we're going to take we'll call it a little break here uh from the music and this is a compilation of uh stuff from a show it's called rickyisms and what rickyisms is is it's uh, from a character named Ricky on uh, essentially a Canadian staple show called the Trailer Park Boys. And unfortunately, he's not too good with the English language and kind of mixes stuff up all the time. And it's pretty funny. Just keep in mind, there are uh, it is <laughs> there, there are there are some vulgarities in there, quite a number of them. But it's all good taste. So we're going to take a quick break and a, kind of, we'll call it a, a quick uh, comedic relief here. And then we'll get back to the music in just a few minutes. So here we go with Rickisms from a Canadian staple show called the Trailer Park Boys. Dig this. This is pretty funny, even if you've never seen the show. I just don't know how to express myself sometimes when I need to be properly different. Fuck. Number one, we're on probation, which is no big deal, but, you know, I don't really want to go back to jail. And number two or three or whatever number we're on, you know, he's getting all frustrated and you can go to college and get your little PFD or whatever the fuck it's called. I don't care. Just remember, Leahy, what comes around is all around. Don't you mean what's all around comes around, Ricky? It's pretty effed up if we can't leave our daughter with my father for half an hour. Well, it's pretty effed up if the last time Ray took care of Trinity, she came home all effed up. She had a few effing drinks. Hey, Leahy, knock, knock. Who's there, Rick? Mr. Stupidy Head, that's fucking pissing me off right now. Thinks he's the captain of the shit liner. And by the way, your fish stick sucks, so fuck off. Looks like a tropical earthquake blew through here or something, man. What the fuck are you looking at, huh? Don't fucking stare Leave at me. Leave my cat alone. Don't fucking stare at me. He's gonna give us homemade hot dogs when I finish putting the signs up. I'm gonna give you some homemade fuck offs right now. What are you doing using your big school words? Just use normal people words and I'll understand what you're talking about. Hey Sam, knock knock! Who's there? Get the fuck off the stage, you idiot! Supply and command. Mr. Denial and Error would probably say knock knock. You'd say who's there and you'd say a fucking idiot and tell you to fuck off. That's, That's what I'd do. Like little Pronagus! It's Piranha, Rick. That's what I said, Pronagus. But the other thing is, it's a Catch-23 situation. It's not a ladybug, it's a caterpillar. Same as some of those sweet and powered chicken things. And getting caught masturbating sucks. Like I got caught masturbating in jail seven or eight times, and it really sucks. Make like a tree and fuck off. But you make my words, I'm gonna get my grade 10. The child reports? What? <laughs> What's an aptitude test? Suitability test, Ricky. Well, I'll wear a suit if I have to, I don't care. How to get bourbon stains out of kahiki pants? It's khaki, Ricky, it's a collar. Whatever. This is fucked, lady. Why don't you go home, Rick? Why don't you fuck off? Go get some hyposuction. I just don't understand investments. I told you that. Ricky! 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 That's willful destruction of garbage! Ricky! Oh, lady was her mother's maiden name. And... Her, her mating name? Yeah. Her maiden name. What in the fuck are you dressed up like a bumblebee for? And why do you look like Indianapolis Jones? It's like he's got these things going on upstairs in his brain compartment that aren't working properly. He's got these fucking psychological shit going on, and you better fucking watch himself, I tell you, because he's going to fucking get hammered. I'm fucked over for being electrocuted. It doesn't take rocket appliances to realize all you got to do is take a fucking chain, hook it up to a truck, and yank the fucking bank machine out of the store. Gorilla, see Gorilla. Do you have a search warranty? What, do you own space? No, NASA does. Exactly. Get two birds stoned at once. Look, I know right now I'm supposed to swallow my prize, but I'm fucking pissed off, man. They cheated. No. Apparently it's clear to see who makes the pants here. Sorry, boys. What if he has rabies? Ricky, it's rabies with a B, not rabies. Basically peach and cake. But Julian doesn't grow, won't burn him. I'm just stretched too. Home trees, boys. And he passed with flying fucking carapace. Breaker Breaker, come in Earth. This is rocket ship 27. The aliens fucked over the carbonator in engine number four. I'm gonna try to refoculate it and land on Juniper. And uh, hopefully they got some space weed over. How's that, buddy? I, I don't fucking know. Ricky, that's not very good. Use space words, real ones, not talking about space weed. These uh, power rockets are firing all over the place. They've got lasers there and shooting and, uh... Bubbles, I can't fucking do this. What the kind of person to say a toad or so? But you know what? A toad or so. A fucking a toad or so. Travis was golfing with flames? Yeah, like flames fucking golfing, golfing, golfing at the roof, out the fucking door. It was golfing. There was nothing I could do. In worst case, Ontario, you get caught, you just cancel the check. You never have to pay. No way. Fucking decknos, man. Check those out. Like, I'm probably smarter than that. I mean, this thing here is smarter than me, I guess, but it has a battery. It's 60 bucks for to say that maybe you'll look after it. 
Four to say? I got sixty dollars, four to say that you'll babysitter. Julian starts feeding me this bullshit. Oh, I don't have insurance on my car. Like, I don't have insurance on my car. Do you rock? I'm not a pessimist, I'm an optometrist. How's a little bottle of joy doing? Holy fuck, Rakins! That's what those furry little bitches are, Julian, that are fucking me over Rakins! It's against my vice principles. I will make you have a eternity test if I have to. Just tell me who it was, please. The beating's one thing, but now my dad's got all these psychophysiological stuff in his head. Yeah, lady, just get us our fucking top of the top of the crack. Fucking land papers, Jim. Just get us the fucking land papers, ASAT, put on my mailbox. Survival of the fitness, boys. Well, the chances of getting runt into forest rangers out here is a zero. It's not bears, it's fucking hillabillies. Fuck you, you greasy hillabillies. Hey, don't fuck this up. Those damn cigarettes in there is our lives. And for fuck's sakes, man, take a shower. Look like at a fucking hobolo. <laughs> Now, if that didn't make you laugh, I don't know what would because that is some funny stuff. All those mess-ups of the English language just butchered. So, back to the music. Now we're going to move down to Toronto, which is about an hour and a half away here from London. The band's called the Stormalongs, and the song's called Two Reasonable People. Dig this. Right on, the Stober Longs with two reasonable people. Great tune. Uh, now, with the horn being the song, even though it wasn't quite ska punk, it had that little, uh, some undertones to it. And that being said, I'm going to be leading into a few songs, and these songs have got to be just over 20 years old, and they were on a compilation uh, called the All Skinny Club, actually the second one. 
And its first band up it was my brother's band at the time. The band is called Gangster Politics, and the song is called Land O Buds. Dig this. Jack. 